I'm Keith Fraser, the Chair of the Youth Justice Board for England and Wales. As stewards of the youth justice system, the Youth Justice Board, or YJB as many of you know it, has a duty to be transparent about our goals, strategies and outcomes. By holding ourselves accountable to measurable objectives and regular reporting on progress across the sector, we aim to build trust and confidence in our strategic direction. Our new strategic plan directs how we will achieve this over the next three years, laying out our priorities to deliver a more impactful Youth Justice Board. One that is more efficient, more inclusive and more effective. The strategic objectives support this direction. Firstly, we will support the improvement of youth justice services in local communities. Secondly, we will focus on addressing persistent disparities across the youth justice system, including those that reflect children's racial heritage. Our third objective is to influence policy and practice to increase the adoption of the child first framework throughout the youth justice system. To deliver on these objectives, we must ground our approach in data that demonstrates effective practice and sound research. This underpins our approach in the strategic plan. We will continue to contribute to the effective resourcing of youth justice services to set clear standards for justice to support improved performance across the sector. We will use our data and evidence to identify opportunities to innovate and improve while promoting and strengthening engagement with communities and victims. We will continue to monitor services constructively challenging our statutory partners and agencies. We will ensure that they have a clear focus on how they are going to respond to the needs of children in their area. We will also inform and influence practitioners and policymakers about the operation of youth justice system and how best to apply the child first framework to deliver positive outcomes. The strategic plan requires a commitment to continuous improvement and collaboration. We must be willing to adapt and evolve our approaches in response to changing needs, emerging evidence and varying resources. In achieving this, we can ensure that our efforts are targeted and impactful in preventing offending, reducing offending and promoting positive outcomes for children. We strongly encourage you to embrace these priorities, embed them into your local strategies and work with the YJB to make a meaningful difference in the lives of children and the communities we serve. Thank you.